This is JB's Baseball Cards with a hobby box of 2022 Topps Chrome Allen & Ginter. Um, I like this product a lot better than just regular Allen & Ginter. The cards are really cool. You're supposed to get 18 packs with four cards in a pack and include one mini. Uh, from the boxes I've seen, I've opened one. I'm going to make a recap video of that. Um, and from ones I've seen on videos online, you get anywhere from like four to seven or eight I've seen parallels. So that would be cool to get one of those or an autograph. I got this at my local uh, card store. Um, I think one in one case, one in the case you get uh, um, an autograph. So that'd be cool to get an autograph or also an X-Fractor parallel, which those are numbered. Or they usually only make like 10 of those. I'm not sure how many they made this year, but in the last couple of years, they're supposed to only make 10 of them per, uh, per card. So we'll see uh, what, what I can find in here. Looks like I got a blue parallel to start off. There's a Garrett Cole on front. These cards look really cool. Uh, there's a Miguel Cabrera mini. That's pretty cool. Um, just the regular Allen and Ginter design, except for... Um, just being in chrome form. Nice, Chris Bryant. I'll take that as a Cubs fan, even though he's not on the Cubs anymore. Still a blue parallel in the Cubs color. These are numbered, this one's numbered 10 out of 150. So I'm happy with that one as a Cubs fan. I've also noticed that uh, you get a lot of minis, mini parallels. So that'd be cool to get a good player mini parallel of. All right, here's Duplass. Here is the baseball lexicon, Chin Music. There's Joe West and Cattell Marte. Chin Music, of course, being a uh, pitcher throws it high and tight to a batter. Back him off the plate, a little Chin Music. That'd be really cool. I've opened up a few of these boxes in the past from the different year, last couple years, haven't pulled an autograph. That'd be really cool to get one. There's Carlos Correa, Ernie Banks, Nahur Mini, and a Tony Wynn. Let's check the odds. I think the X-Factor one in 216, so that's probably about, the orange is one in 108. So they make maybe 10 to 12 of the X-Factor cards. I have pulled an x Factor before, but not an autograph out of this product. There's Ethan Roberts, so that's my second Cub. Happy to get that. Brian De La Cruz Refractor. You should get about six refractors in each box, based on the odds. Inside the park, Rocky Mountain National Park, and Austin Meadows. I'd be really happy to get five parallels. Um... More than that would be just a ton. Looks like it's gonna be a gold parallel here. I got a Robin Young on front, Larry Walker on the back, two Hall of Famers there. The mini is Eloy Jimenez, and the gold is Anthony Rizzo. This is a former Cub hot box. Rizzo's number 27 out of 50, which I'll definitely take them. Wish they were in the Cub uniform still. Um, legendary Cubs and um, possible. I think they both have a chance to get in the Hall of Fame if they, uh, you know, have good ends to their careers, second halves of their careers. There's Otto Lopez rookie card, Steve Carlton, Julio Arias, and the mini is Roy Campanella. It's getting a lot of Hall of Famers too. I'll take it. Got this for a hundred bucks at my local card store. There's Torres, not sure who that is. Balkovec. Uh, baseball Lexicon, Shoestring Catch, and Tatis Jr. The one thing about Alan Ginter is not all of the cards will feature baseball players. A lot of uh, pop culture references. Not all baseball. So I'm going to get a green mini here. There's Roy Campanella, base card. Trey Turner. Let's see who the green is. Procky. This is the Cubs PA announcer. So not exactly a baseball player. Still in the Cubs uniform, which I like. So that's nice. 
and Adam Wainwright. This is a box that is very tangential, tan tangential to the Cubs. Not Cubs, current Cubs players, but still related to the Cubs. There's a Chipper Jones, that's a cool looking card. It looks like early in his playing days. Tony Santion, rookie card. Mike Piazza mini. And a Roger Maris, which you don't see a lot of his cards and current products. I'm about halfway through the box here. Got some good cards already. Hoping to get a case hit. That'd be really cool. Looks like I got a green coming up. Oh, nice. Say a Suzuki. I did get this mini in my first box, but I'll take another one. That's cool. Todd Helton. Uh, Nyher base card. And a Johnny Bench green. That's really nice. I've got some good parallels here. I'm, I'm pleased with. Johnny Bench, Hall of Famer. Arguably the best catcher of all time. Number 74 out of 99. That's a really cool card. So I've been pretty pleased with all my parallels so far. Yeah, you can get some more valuable cards. But just in terms of, you know, good players and uh, good names, it's hard to beat. Or players that a Cubs fan would like. There's Eloy Jimenez. Trey Mancini, who's now on the Cubs. Roger Clemens, many. And Salvador Perez. Clemens should be in the Hall of Fame, but... Steroid accusations and maybe admissions have kept him out of it so far. All right. There's a Mike Trout base. Definitely take that one. That's a cool card. Reggie Jackson refractor. These refractors, the Hall of Famers, are sweet. Uh, another in the park. This one of Joshua Tree National Park. And a Cody Bellinger, another current Cub. All right, there's Frank Robinson, Charlie Blackman, Marcus Stroman, who pitched a good game on opening day for the Cubs, and Murphy, who's a comedian. All right, got five packs left. I'm going to get one more parallel. That would put me at the five, which I was hoping to get. Sammy Sosa on the back. I saw he had autographs in this product. There's a Walker Bueller. Yogi Berra, Hall of Famer. I think that's Blake Jameson. He does some of the artwork. Yep. There's Sammy Sosa. Some of the artwork for, like, Topps Project 70 or whatever they call it. And he does other, uh, like, Topps Fire... He's done a lot of artwork at the top, so they gave him a card here. There's a Ryan Sandberg. Looks like he got a Magenta, so that is five. So that's nice. There's Buster Posey Mini. Ryan Sandberg Base. Matt Olson. And the pink. Scott. Rodney Scott, a barbecue chef. Numbered 129 out of 199. If all of my parallels were of pop culture references, I'd be upset, but most of them have been of ball players, so I can't complain too much. Unless, of course, I was a big fan of whoever was the pop culture. There's Matt Chapman, Mel Ott, another of the Inside the Park, Mesa Verde National Park, and Manny Machado. All right, two packs left here. Still looking for a potential case hit. That'd be really, that would be the cherry on top if I get one of those. Grushka, Diego Castillo Refractor, Willie McCovey Mini, and Brownell. I don't remember seeing her softball player. All right, last pack coming up. And I'll do a quick recap of the parallels. There's an Otani base, Joe Ryan Mini. Aaron Nola, and Will Smith. So overall, pretty pleased with that. Got a lot of cool cards, a lot of cool numbered ones, five, which is pretty nice and a lot related to the Cubs. There's a Scott numbered out of 199, Magenta Parallel. Johnny Bench numbered out of 99, Green Parallel. 
green parallel of, I think it's Jeremiah Proprocki, Cubs PA announcer. Number down to 99. Gold parallel, Anthony Rizzo. Really nice. My cousin Bob would really like this one. Number 27 out of 50. And then the Chris Bryant blue. Numbered 10 out of 150. So no rookie card parallels or any of those high value cards. Still, there's some more refractors too. Just some cool looking cards. And for 100 bucks, I think you could do a lot worse than this. Um, just cards they don't make a ton of and no retail format. Just a lot of fun and cards I'll look down five years down the road in my collection and just be really happy I have all these in my collection. Thanks again for watching. Let me know what you think of these cards. I think they're really awesome. Let me know if you got anything big out of them. I'd love to hear if you pulled something cool. Thanks again for watching. Hope you're having a good day. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Go Cubs.